Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Mod Fallout New Vegas. This is James Seth Lynch and it's time to input this code that we got. Oh, and I also did some more looting and found this ammo. Password is the better part of valor. Stay where you are. I'm sending someone up to meet you. Aha! Uh -huh. We get to meet people. Okay. Whoa. Power armor. Listen very closely and do as I say. Your life depends on it. And over everything you're carrying. Weapons, ammo, clothes, armor, everything. I want you stripped down to your underwear. What's going on here? I've told you what to do. Strip off your clothes and equipment or face summary execution. Will you comply? Okay, I'll comply. Take it all off and hand it to me. Then come inside and through the door at the rear of the chamber. Paladin Ramos is waiting for you. And, yeah, modded companions, so. Where did you learn that password? And tell the truth, because I'll know if you're lying. Who are you? I'm the one asking the questions right now, and you still haven't answered me. I suggest you start doing so. Why do you look so spooked? The password you gave is valid, but old. The only way you could have gotten it is from one of our lost patrols. I found some of your people dead in the waste. They had it on them. An interesting story. It may even be true. Under normal circumstances, your story wouldn't make any difference. You'd be dead already. Lucky for you. Probably. Elder McNamara wants to meet you. So follow me, closely, or you'll be killed. I think his voice acting kind of failed there in that last sentence. And you two are really breaking the importance of this scene. I've been informed that you bring us ill tidings, stranger. Care to elaborate? No, what I told your men before was the truth. I don't like repeating myself. I applaud your commitment to your own word, though it saddens me to hear of the fate of our comrades. You took an extreme risk in coming here. My policy towards trespassers has not been lenient. The security of this bunker is my foremost concern, and I take pains to minimize our exposure topside. For this reason, I might be interested in contracting with an outsider who can accomplish certain tasks. Some basic, some a bit more involved. An NCR ranger has begun to set up post in one of the other bunkers up top, for example. I want him driven off. Understood? Why haven't you killed the ranger already? Yes, we could kill him easily enough. But sometimes you can learn a great deal by observing people, both enemies and friends. Which is why it will be very interesting to observe how you choose to deal with the situation and decide which you are, enemy or friend. Do we understand one another? I can take care of the ranger. Very well. I'll be interested to see how thoroughly and efficiently you carry out your mission. Paladin Ramos will escort you back to the bunker's entrance and set you loose. Notice that I said loose, not free. You are not free to carry the secret of this bunker's location beyond Hidden Valley. Until I'm convinced that you're capable and dependable. To underscore this point, you'll be fitted with an explosive collar. Wander off and it will detonate. Focus on your mission, and you'll be fine. An explosive collar. An explosive freaking... You'll find your equipment in the chest to your right. Don't bother coming back until you've dealt with the ranger. 
Okay. Well, we got no answers as to who the hell these people are. I got this thing. Oh, apparently. And it weighs five freaking pounds. So it's heavy. Okay, but I know exactly what's in there. And five pounds is a lot in this game. That's the weight of my cowboy repeater. Ugh. Or a caravan lunch. Or two caravan lunches, I think. Whatever. Anyway, to the wasteland we go. Wait, why is it? Oh, I can't put my black scarf on. No. Okay, so. Maybe we could get some answers from the ranger. He might know what's going on. Oh, knackered. I had the worst night's sleep last night. When we're camped out, some prick comes along, shakes me, wakes me up. Starts wanting on about bottle caps. Don't worry though, I took care of it. Show me his stupid face that went back to bed. Problem solved. I think it's this bunker. I don't use the quest markers, so. Is it this bunker? So as usual, we can go about this many, many different ways, how to deal with the ranger. He can actually set us free, uh, which will meet us with a squad of those guys to kill us. And power armor is nothing to laugh at. Neither are energy weapons. See, oh, I'm in the same... That's it. That's it. Turn quest markers on. Let's speed this along, shall we? This way. So apparently if we leave, we'll get our head exploded. You know, I wonder... If the Brotherhood of Steel made these collars, or perhaps they scavenged them from pre-war tech. Nah, what the? You know, as I said, perhaps they scavenged them from pre-war tech. Nah, why would America need explosive collars? It's not like they would have compliance issues or anything. Where the hell is this bunker? Oh. I did not do that. No, that's just gonna lead to my death. so hard to find because they're bunkers they're supposed to be hard to find people are hiding I don't know why my gun keeps firing off like that hey, you ever heard this Mr. New Vegas guy on the radio shut up Niner he's okay but I'll do a way better job than him 
Hey, maybe that's what I should do when I get to Vegas. You know, storm in there, take over the place. Open the new station. I'll call it Radio. Because you know, I raided the place. Hey. And, uh, right. So if the radio were happened to be smashed, he would leave. And I would steal all his food. Ammo! Oh. Question is, where is he? Oh, let's just equip the leather backpack. Save us some time. Yeah. gonna show up. Does he not show up? Is he... <laughs> okay, this is, this is frustrating me now. Where the heck is he? I have a bad feeling about this. There he is. Now I'm getting the worst feeling. The worst feeling. Okay, here he is. Thought you'd sneak up on me, you filthy powder ganger? I'm not a powder ganger. Exactly what powder ganger scum would say. Any last words before I pull this trigger? I'm not a powder ganger. Relax, son. Just pulling your leg. What can I do for you? I hate you already. And I'll see you guys in the next episode since I'm running out of time. <laughs>